Santa Claus dolls and it's Christmas and for this video I'm coming with a collaboration with my doll friend Harley Doll's House. I'm going to put her link in the description box below so that you can check her video. The name of the collaboration is Anti-Christmas and no one better than the Grinch. I love the Grinch. Have you seen the movie? It's amazing. You have to check it out now Christmas evening. But before, don't forget to check out my video. Bye! I'm gonna use a Venus. She doesn't have lower arm and ends. I stole one of Frankie's. I wanna give her uh, gloves, red gloves, so it doesn't matter. I'm gonna paint them. And I'm gonna start cleaning her, cutting the hair really short with my hair dryer making the vinyl of the hair soft so I can pop up the head out of the body easily and take the rest of the hair from inside of the head through the neck hole. With 100% acetone I clean the face. When she's ready, I give it three layers of mist to super clear, let it dry for 30 minutes between the layer, using always my mask, don't forget that, and with my favorite watercolor pencils Druent, my soft pastels Rembrandt, I start to sketch her face. I look in the Pinterest for inspiration and I found this one that I think it's amazing. So I start to giving her the iconic yellow eyes and yellow eyeshadow. I want to give her a little heart in her nose and I also want to give her the wrinkles in the nose also that go around the cheek. I'm using a light color of brown because if I made a mistake it's easier to erase it than if I use directly a darker color and then gradually I'm using different, different shades of green and yellows to give it dimension to the face of my doll to give it dimension to the wrinkles of the nose and her face What you gonna do by Christmas? I'm gonna just stay home with my family with my two daughters and my husband open a lot of presents because I love presents with soft pastels in the green color I shape the eyebrows and then I come with a watercolor pencil and I give it little small hairs and details and between the layers I'm building the opacity that I wanted and all the details that I wanted for her face trying to build the character of Grinch I give her also green eyes In the beginning I give her red lips and then I change it to the upper lip in a dark green and then the bottom lip in red. I think it's give it another touch. After I achieve the look that I wanted then I can start building more opacity with the shadows with soft pastels in yellow, greens, whites and also with the watercolor pencils every time sealing it with Mr. Super Clear and let it dry for 30 minutes I don't know for you guys but Christmas is the best day of the year for me <laughs> I love it and also my birthday of course
with white acrylic and a small brush I give it the eye catches and the details I also give a more opacity to the black parts of the face with black acrylic. I'm using a really fine black marker to make the bottom eyelashes. I learned this from Jackie O. Thank you Jackie! I love the tip, it's really good, it works it. I'm gonna give her a green hair and for that I'm using 100% acrylic yarn that I brush it with a pet brush and then with my hair straightener I make him smooth and shiny like this. For our inspiration look, I found this amazing drawing for Aidan Williams. He's an amazing artist, amazing designer. You have to check it out because it's a, it's, it's a fountain of inspiration for everyone, especially for me. Slowly I'm building the hair with hot glue and I want to give her the look of the ponytails. For that I'm going to put the pompons in the middle. I'm not using the normal pompons. I'm using ones that are more uh, stable, they are more hard and I cover them with the acrylic yarn and for the extensions I cover the pompon directly with the acrylic yarn with hot glue and then I put it in the middle of the rest of the yarn that is attached on her head and I cover the rest around it I decorated with Christmas laces, Christmas decorations, pompons, and I love it. I give it a, a gold crown. I just have to style the rest of the hair when she's ready. For the clothes, I'm gonna use this glitter red fake glitter and this sticky fabric with some fluffy that I'm gonna cover in the inside. I'm gluing directly to the skirt and then I just finish it in the end of the skirt and trim it a little bit with my scissors. I'm trimming the fluffy fabric a little bit because I want to close the skirt with this velcro. For the Santa Claus bell, 
I'm gonna use this uh, gold belt and the black fake leather. For the top I'm gonna do exactly the same. I found these, these Christmas earrings that I thought they were perfect for the decoration so I'm gonna use one on the top with a pompon and that how it looks, I love them and as I told you I'm gonna paint the bottom arms and hands in red acryl glossy paint I will protect all of the accessories, including the gloves, the hands, with Liquitex Glossy Varnish. I choose these shoes from Monster High that I'm gonna paint them in Christmas colors, red, green and gold. And I finish with this little Christmas white pompon that I think is really, really cute. For the bag, I found this one. I don't know if it's Monster High or not. If you know it, let me know in the comments below. And about the comments below, don't forget to watch the video until the end because I have a really, really nice surprise for all of you in the end of my video. And I'm using the same colors, red, green and gold for my bag. And I finish with this glitter glue in red color. And I decorated with this Christmas lace, red and gold and I attach the other earring with some more pompons and she looks so cute. It's time for the eyelashes and glossy lips, nose and eyes with the Amsterdam glossy varnish and my Grinch is ready. And there she is. I love her. She's so pretty. Do you see her face? Yeah. I'm so happy with my Grinch. And don't forget to check out the video of Arley. Is it, the link is in the description box. And hmm, it's Christmas today. So it's Presents Day. Um, and I think I have a present for you. Let me check it out. Yes, I have a present for all of you. The new Monster High. Clear of the Night Generation 3. I know that everyone loves them. I love them also. I have Draculara, I have Cleo, I have Claudine, Laguna and Twyla. Draculara is really really difficult to get, especially here in Europe, because we she's they don't they are not in the store yet, but um, yeah, I have this present for you. The only thing you have to do to get this clear new for you that I'm gonna send it is you have to subscribe my channel, like it, leave a comment saying subscribe 
and Merry Christmas. And then in my next video, I'm gonna let us see who wins this amazing doll. Please, if someone sends you a message saying that you win a doll or something like that, don't believe it, it's not true, it's not me. I'm gonna do it in my next video. I'm gonna scroll all the comments of the people that subscribe in this video and I'm gonna choose one of them. I make a screenshot and I let you see directly on the video who is winning this doll. So I wish you a Merry Christmas to all of you and I see you in my next video. Bye!